good morning. It is Friday, April the 5th. I hope it's the 5th. Yes, it is the 5th. And it is 9 o'clock. We slept in a little bit. We had some breakfast. And plugged in the new hotspot. We're going to see if that's going to work. We'll probably use it maybe this evening to see if it how well it does on a live feed. Hopefully it is what we were wanting. I don't honestly don't know. I'm hoping it is what we need, what we want, and we'll find out. So we are currently waiting for an offer. We have Grubhub and Uber Eats running and I put that I do not want to do any Uber X or shopping on Uber today. But we'll see how that goes. We're going to head towards a hotspot area and see what we get. Don't know what's going to happen today, but we do have our trusty coffee with us. We have our new merch shirt on and we're just going to go see how this goes. So, thank you all for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. We are climbing and scratching our way ooh, to 1,000 subs. And just thank you all. Y'all have a great day. We will be back as soon as we get an offer. Okay, y'all. We have a Home Depot offer in the Spark app. To pick up at 9:45. I've never done a Home Depot pickup. Hopefully, it's nothing big. It says it's two of one item, and why not, guys? Let's take this. Of course, we'll have to wait till 7:45 or so. So, because if I hit, it's only 2.2 miles from the store. So if I hit that, it's going to tell me that you're too early. See, it's right there. It tells you it's a little early. Your ETA is 924. So we'll have to wait a bit. And we might be able to get a food delivery. But we're gonna, let's go do this. All right, guys. So I'm sure you noticed that it is an offer for $8.80. But it's only 2.2 miles from the store. We're really not that far. We're probably about that far from the store. Maybe 2 miles. So, the only thing I don't like on this is that it really does not tell me what it is. It just says PCL705K Quantity 2. Um... And it goes, I think that's the hospital, to be honest. I believe that is the hospital. Let's see. Goes to the Texas Tech um, Clinic. So, yeah, I won't take you in. I probably won't take you in on the pickup. I'm don't always like to especially and I have no idea what this is or anything we are going in blind I don't know you tell me okay they just keep on sending these things these notifications about um, incentives but the thing is these center incentives are only between 6 and 6 a.m. and 8 a.m. and you get a four dollars for each trip for each and it's a shop shopper express so there's shopping orders that one is so is this one and they're at specific stores um i don't even know which stores they're they are so whatever but i was sitting here because this is actually the hot spot at the moment for um Uber Eats. I turn off Grubhub because that way I can actually yeah that's what I figured um 
I won't hack you don't have to deal with that and turning down an offer if it happens to be like way too far away from when we need to pick up this order so um, yeah we're gonna sit here and wait a little bit longer so we have about 20 minutes before we need to pick this up Whew. so we're gonna go do oh man this is interesting cuz I didn't really honestly know that you could do that I mean I knew they picked up for these other shop other locations stores but here it's always just been Sam's or Walmart never anywhere else so we'll be back in a few I'm trying to take you then we're gonna see what happens yeah Shows kind of just like it normally does. Their name. Where do you pick it up? Oh, I don't know. So I have a Walmart Spark pickup for okay. a Maxine Westmoreland. Yeah. Do you have that phone number, order number? <laughs> yeah, you can have it. That's fine. So if you do that, if you it's like I've not ever picked so one up from here before. Hope we'll so. <laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna print you out that delivery paper. Okay, perfect. So and Dave really thought of he liked that. He let me know, and yeah. we didn't. We never put it down anywhere. But, yeah. but it is. It is a it's unique concept. Yeah. So, uh, so if y'all want to do anything like that, that, you can. But if yes, there's nothing sir. else, uh, identify the issues. I'll fix it. You know, we have. Yeah. Because you know, at the, at the, the, the very last page of SOP, there's a there's a like, board on every single one. And it starts off when the manager fell to comply. Right. <laughs> So that means that our job <laughs> is not only to make sure that the associates are doing it, but it's if, they, if we're not making them do it, right. then we're the ones responsible. Right, they did it to service desk. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. You too. It wouldn't look too bad. It'd been a whole lot easier if the receipt would have printed at the service desk. As we know, it did not. So, since it's as at a um, health facility that has children, I will not take you in drop off. But I will see you as soon as we get our next offer. Y'all. So this is actually part of Texas Tech Health Sciences Center and it is a secured facility. This lady left no directions. She acted like she didn't know what I was talking about. No clue what I was talking about. And then she was like, oh, where are you out front? Yeah, I'm at the front door. Oh, well, we're a secured facility. You'll have to go around to the north side of the building and go to the dock, loading dock. Someone gonna meet me there? What's the whole deal here? Oh, my Lanta. Um, hmm. I'll find out. This is gonna irritate the heck out of me.
my goodness, guys. Funny thing is, he was super, super nice. And the funny thing is, is he says, is he said, is this from Home Depot? I said, yeah. And he said, I go, yeah, it goes to Westmoreland. And he said, is she the one that told you to come around here? And I said, yes, sir. He said, she could have just gone to the door and gotten it from you. Well, that's kind of what I thought. It's two small, very small um, items. So I don't know what the heck, but whatever. He's a very nice man. I don't know that I would ever do one of those again, to tell you the truth. And we just got our first offer. It is going to Mickey D's. Let's see. McDonald's. It's 5.1 miles for $5.33. So there you have it guys we did get a grubhub offer I'm trying to figure out which way i need to go um hopefully grubhub will be our friend today and let's see will we make or break the 200 dollars today let's see what happens Thank you. Y'all have a good day. Ooh, I have to have a better attitude today. It's the way it's going to go that way. This is a big, 
busy as heck store today. It's usually not that busy. And the wind's gonna blow. It's gonna be worse tomorrow when it comes to the wind. <laughs> Thank you for your order. Have a great day. Alrighty, friends. Let's see what comes next. Well, guys, we did our charitable delivery. It was to Sonic. It was probably a mile from Sonic to the drop-off. And it was to a high school. And they did not tip for three large french fries so that was our pity delivery so or charitable delivery because here's the thing we do not need our stats to drop for not accepting all the orders because last weekend we had some dropped orders i did decline an order on grubhub and with us being gone for 10 days 11 days whatever it's going to be we cannot afford to let our stats drop too much so it was a total of 2.7 miles for two dollars so then we got rewarded well kind of so we're going to slotsky's but it's the Slotsky's on the wrong side of town that I'm not on. So it's 5.9 miles for $10.12. But I'm not complaining today. Or I'm trying not to complain today. Because we need to make $200 plus dollars today. Can we make it? As you know, the goal is always $200 on a day that we dash all day. Which today is our off from our W-2. So, we'll do all day today, all day tomorrow, and all day Sunday. So, hopefully we can make $600. 600 So, let me know in the comments if you think we can make $600 this weekend. Starting with today. So we'll see you at Slotsky's. It's pretty windy. Man. It's beautiful, but it is windy. Yeah, you know what? I'll take it. Tomorrow's wind's supposed to be worse. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so you I'm better off tomorrow. So I wish that. Of course, it will be worse, right? Yep. That's okay. always that's always my luck too. Out. Thank you. 
Alright my friends Let's go out into the Windy world of the bomb city And go get these delivered Did y'all have some food? <laughs> if you'll hold it in, let me take a silly picture. Oh, yay. Okay. I know. Ah, got it. We're good. Perfect. All right. Thank, thank you. you. Be with you just saying. All right. All right, guys. Because it seems that you have to take a picture on everything. So, let's get going, see if we can get next. Alright guys, we have turned on DoorDash. We have a rare but needed dash from 11 to 12. Actually, it's 11.05. So, let's see how much we can get in DoorDash in the next hour. Alright guys, so as soon as I pulled in and parked into the parking lot where five guys and Jersey Mike's is we got an offer from DoorDash it is six dollars and 75 cents plus it is a high pay offer and it said people really you just block the thing it also says total will be higher and it says you need a pizza bag so we will you know rig our medium size Grubhub bag to be a pizza bag so we do that quite often so we're gonna see what we can get you know we're all trying to get this 100 deliveries since that horrible contract violation that was not necessarily in my opinion it was not my fault I went where the GPS told me to go so that is not my fault but you know what i'm not gonna mess with it i don't even care we are just gonna get this hundred deliveries under our belt get rid of this contract violation and make a little bit of money so as you know we will not take you in to nomad pizza because one they're never ready two their music is so loud that i get a copyright infringement every single time I go in there so it's not worth it so we will see you at the drop-off but y'all okay when I went to Sonic and got the french fries for the high school student that didn't tip the lady that handed me the food she is super nice she's all every time I go in there she's been very nice one time they had actually made a wrong drink and she gave it to me so today she hands me this little flyer right here for sonic and she tells me it is for you not your customer and it's like you can get a large soft drink for 99 cents a 32 ounce you can get a medium onion drink for 99 cents there's a coupon for a small chili cheese talk for 99 cents. You can get a small jumbo popcorn for $1.99. A regular breakfast burrito combo for $2.99. And you can also get a 
foot long quarter pounder coney get a foot long quarter pounder coney free when you buy one so that was pretty awesome of her and you know i just love that lady she is such a nice sweet person so we are off to get this pizza we'll see you at the drop off For Mike. Did they get you tipped? Um, I can tell you in a minute. Yes. They did. Okay. Yes. We just want to make sure. They sure did. Thank, Thank you. you You're much. welcome. Y'all have a great day. Thank you. Too. Thank you. So it went up to $8. So, I mean, yeah, they tipped, but not great. I mean, it went from $6.75 to $8. So that was an extra $1.25. So it's not bad. I mean, I took it out at what it was. So. I mean, I'm not going to tell them that they didn't tip me, which some people might have done, but nah. We'll just see what else we can get. And we'll see you back in a few. Y'all, we are playing Take Every DoorDash Order. 5.5 uh, miles, $3.50 to Chick-fil-A. Mm-hmm. You heard that right. Chick-fil-A. But we're right here anyway, so we are going to run in and go get it. Hopefully, it's ready. We'll go find out. I just don't want to get run over in a Chick-fil-A drive-thru. It's two um, orders. So let's uh, check it out and we'll see you in a minute. All right, guys, it is our. Mm, what do you want to call it? This $3.50 order is also going to a high school student across town. That's why it's so many miles because there's not a Chick fil A on their side of town. So 
we are on our way to the high school so I will not see you at the drop-off because there I prefer not to to do that so we'll see you when we get our next offer all right so we turned Grubhub back on and we got this offer it is to Jason's Deli of course it's the one that's not even close to where we are but that's okay it was for 7.3 miles six dollars 56 cents because we're one two three four four and a half miles probably at least four miles from the restaurant so there you have it my peeps um i want to shout out to jennifer i want to welcome you to the bomb city dash crew whatever I've got to come up with the name. I had a name and then now of course my brain has slept since then so I don't remember. Um, yeah. But we will definitely have a name for our membership peeps. But thanks Jennifer for joining. We greatly appreciate you and the other members. It really helps out the channel. We're able to do a few things. It helped actually um, a donation helped me to pay for the uh, new software that we're using for our videos granted I need to learn more about how to use it but um, it is working for us so I have researched that particular one in the beginning before I found the Canva that you know was working so wonderfully that now it is not but that's all right guys let's go pick this up and we'll see you soon all these cars are parked right there and it all says no parking because there isn't enough room to get out all right guys let's see if our customers order is ready don't know she does have a tea, and then I'm not sure on this delivery drop off. Is it has an address and then it has like a suite number but then I don't know it's just a little confusing that car has a low tire I wonder if that's just the hurts people yes it is all right let's go get it delivered all right guys oh the sun we are on a quest to accept to accept every order we are now going to tie our one Whew. It is 7.2 miles for an additional $6.05 and is going in the opposite direction of where Jason's Deli gets dropped off. That always makes me think there's not many people out here delivering right now. So let's go get this picked up. Y'all, people are crazy drivers. This lady came flying into the parking lot as I'm trying to get to the parking lot exit and she just like cut across and had I not been paying attention and slam on the brakes she would have wiped out my whole front end which might not have been so bad because she was driving a Lexus I'd have gotten a new car but him forbid I don't need that right now so that's just crazy I don't know what these people are thinking it's beautiful today that is the problem you know nice beautiful days bring out the crazy in people so let's go get this picked up make sure we don't get run over by some crazy person in the parking lot hello pick up for miles Thank you. Thank you, you too. Why 
Well, there we go, my friends. It was ready. Woohoo! Now let's go get these two dropped off. Five. Have a great day. Thank you. Let's see where I'm going. Good, and you? Yeah. Uh, food delivery. Awesome. Probably gonna make me take a picture. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, it's all good. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a great day. You Thank you. Oh, now we got to go down so we can deliver this next one. So. We'll see you at the next drop off. afternoon all right guys and we have another order i'll tell you about it in a moment oh all right guys all right this battery's about to die too um we are going to the other slot skis it is 9.7 miles for eight dollars and 98 cents so let's go and we'll see you there for your order have a great day all right my friends let's see if we can get anything else today before we go have some dinner all right my friends it is 1 30 and we do have another order and we're going to the lazy gator and they're never ready i don't even think they're never mm, yeah no so I am going to leave you right here in the car and then we will come back once we get home and figure out how much we made on this weirdo Friday morning that we started late that we did get to see hubby this morning when he got home so that's always a plus and we just need $200 so for the whole day. So hopefully tonight will be an awesome delivery payout so that whatever we made today will add to that and make $200. So we'll see. Um, dude, stay in your lane. Um, yeah, so that's where we are. We are gonna go pick this up and we'll see you at home with the numbers. Or we'll see you in the car on the way home after we pick up our dinner. So we'll be back. Thank you all for being here. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you and all of you 
all of your support that you give to the channel and it just y'all just bless me every single day so thank you so much and we'll see you in a bit all right guys so <sighs> we delivered to I don't know if y'all have seen in some of my previous videos, there's a house that we delivered to that has a really cool um, old car in the in the yard. It's like bright yellow. Um, delivered to that person. They used to work at my W-2 a long time ago. Um, but they also adopted one of my dachshunds that, so I had two dachshunds and they had their first litter that they had. They had she always only had three so this little dog we just we had i don't know somehow we ended up with another what we had sold one and then the people brought it back and i had told them they couldn't bring it back and they wouldn't get their money back but my husband at the time gave them their money back and that was on them not us so um but I talked to him for just a little bit, which was really nice. And um, Harley passed away, I think he said, a year, just recently, maybe to a year or so ago. So it was nice to have a conversation with him. So we've been out six hours. Ooh, no. And we made not very much money. Huh. 71.82 in six hours. So we made 11.97 an hour, which honestly, it's not horrible because um, the last few weeks we have made less than that. I'm pretty sure on Friday in the morning, in the morning, not the whole day usually I come back in the evening and make up the difference to make the $200 so that's what we're hoping for we are gonna go pick up our dinner lunch whatever you want to call it and run home eat talk with hubby for a little bit and come back out and we will see you back here here in a bit and man guys it is getting windier the longer the days going on the windier it is getting so hmm, that restaurant now has I don't know if it I don't think it's a restaurant I don't know what it is but we are going to like I said go get our food I should have gone a different way but oh well I didn't went this way so we'll see you back on the next video because I'm going to split these and turn this video into its own video and tonight's video into its own video. So thanks for being here. I appreciate you all. Like I have said, y'all are just amazing and we are working our way one step at a time, one subscriber at a time to get to 1000 subscribers. Appreciate you all. We'll see you tonight.